did you retrieve any of these items? For no. example, these two paintings? Nothing at all. Nothing like, like that. that. What about you, Mr. Gutierrez? Uh, what about these items? Um, Were they in your home when the plaintiff was arrested? Looking at these, I do not recall. How big is your apartment? It's not an apartment, it's a trailer, but... It's a trailer? Uh, yeah, four rooms. And you claim that you never saw those paintings? I never saw them. These have never graced, like, my presence at least, but... So how do we account for that? Honestly, all I can say is that um, the entire time I was with him, he'd lied to me. So I'm sure that he'd do the exact same to you. These items, are they your own paintings? You painted these things? Yes, Your Honor. And did you actually hang them in the trailer? There was one that was hung, which was one of Necro Valley. There were three characters from Necro Valley, and that one was hung in the trailer. He does for sure know about that one, but I don't have any pictures of it. Okay. Mr. Gutierrez, what property do you recall turning over to the plaintiff's mother? I recall returning all of her belongings to... Well, when you say all of her belongings, can you be a I little mean, more specific? The clothes that she had, shoes, you know, stuff like that. Any jewelry? Jewelry, yes. Like, I did not want anything to do with any of her property. I want to get everything out because it was a very hard situation for me and right. I really didn't want to think about it, like put the whole situation behind me. So I packed up everything. I went through my room, packed up everything, gave it to her. You didn't dispose of any of the, the plaintiff's property in any other way? No, sir. I left it on the bench in the driveway before she had come, like uh, 30 minutes before she had came. So you put the property outside. Mm -hmm and the plaintiff's mother didn't arrive until about 30 minutes after you left the property? Yeah. Are there other people in the area? Yeah. Was it wise to leave it unattended? In hindsight, no, it wasn't wise, but yeah. And, but you're sure that none of the items that are in that exhibit were items that you were aware of as belonging to the plaintiff and disposed of? That is correct, yeah. All right, Judge DeWalda? So I'm looking at a number of these paintings, drawings, and they're pretty big. Relatively. Where in his place were they? The day that I had left, they should have all either been in the living room or in the room that we had shared. Okay, so there's pictures of your room, Mr. Gutierrez, that you provided. So pretty tight space, not enough space to have all of those drawings. How big is the living room? It's a decent size, I would say. So unless Mr. Gutierrez is just lying about having them at all, it's kind of hard to miss, don't you think? I, I think they'd be extremely hard to miss. Mom, can you stand for a second? How many times did you go to the defendant's home to try to get your daughter's things? Twice. What did you pick up the first time? A bag of clothes, you said? Yeah, there was a trash bag of clothes. There was a box that had two little backpacks in there with some other little stuff that she had. It was basically nothing. You text him asking if that was everything, right. correct? And you said, hey, Jean, so I finally went through Ariana's stuff, but does she have hygiene things, shoes, clothes, or anything else? Right. He gave me one pair of shoes, and she has two big black pairs of boots. I don't know how you can miss those. I mean, one of them, the heels are like this big. He even wore them one time on a Halloween party. They switched like he was the woman and she was the man. <laughs> Thank you for that. Um, <laughs> didn't you find those shoes and try to return them? You found something after you gave her yeah. what you thought was all of the plaintiff's stuff, right? That is correct, yes. And you found more things, like what? I had found a jersey, some shoes, but... Um, not those? Not, not those. Okay. No. Basically, the remainder, like strings, wire beads, it was like a whole little case. That and you attempted to things. give those things back? Yeah, and those were the things that I had forgotten that I did return. I don't find any reason not to believe Mr. Gutierrez, because I was reading through the text, he was very helpful in trying to get your things to your mom.